Hello traders, this is Rich from TradeSite. This is a look at our market leading stocks via our proprietary scans for the coming session. This is going to be for Tuesday, August 20th, 2013. Right now we've got kind of a, a bifurcated day with weakness in the uh, broad market side and we're uh, seeing a little bit of relative strength in the NASDAQ side. But having said that, we're definitely seeing some, some uh, signs of weakness in the NASDAQ side. If we get under the hood here and take a look at our scans, they're a little bit, little bit biased to the sell side. I've got a volume bump today in Apple. Apple did take out last week's high to the upside and is uh, pulling back significantly off the day's high, leaving us with a differential sell signal. So it's definitely going to be uh, on the forefront of my uh, watch list for tomorrow. Moving on to the financials, a little bit of weakness here. Uh, we've got a good uh, volume bump here in JP Morgan, and uh, we're about 2% below the day's open. So that's definitely in motion, even though we don't have a uh, any kind of a particular uh, signal at the moment. Moving on to the uh, energy patch, this is where we're really seeing a lot of weakness in the broad market concentrated. We've got quite a number of downside CPS conditions and a lot of open close deviations down 3% uh, below the open in BTU, CHK, a lot of these stocks uh, are starting to show some uh, good distribution here today. Valero is also very, very weak, VLO. Moving on to the generals, again we're biased to the sell side, not not tremendously, but definitely uh, leaning that way. Uh, I've got a volume bump in Best Buy, most of these names outside of that are not, not trading uh, extraordinary volume, but we do have uh, uh, a bit of a bias to the downside in the generals. Moving on to the housing names, some of these names are very weak today. Uh, Havnanian's not quite 5% below the day's open on a volume bump. And Home Depot seeing uh, down, downside pressure on uh, increased volume as well. So keep an eye on those housing names as they uh, are starting to break down and pick up some more uh, speed to the downside. Not seeing too much in the transport group. And then finally on the commodity patch, we're kind of mixed here. We've got a number of differential buy signals as some... Uh, so folks are kind of rotating that way right now. We're starting to see some of these things pick up a little bit into the close and starting to see, see them lift off of the day's lows. So we're getting that uh, differential buy uh, condition setting up in quite a few names. Again, most, mostly here, uh, fairly light volume with the exception uh, Alcoa AA is uh, over the 100% threshold. So we're, we're finally seeing some typical, uh, typical run rates there. All right, folks, as always, thanks for listening. This has been Rich for TradeSite.